Like, comment and subscribe. Animals are ask people for help. When animals are in trouble, they disregard their wariness of humans and ask them for help. Make sure to watch hey, this man. video till the end and you'll be amazed. When a drowning squirrel was res was rescued from a swimming pool. Amazed. When a drowning squirrel was rescued okay. from a swimming pool, the situation appeared hopeless. Thankfully, the rescuer knew how to perform first aid on squirrels. Well, that's a bit can how the hell? It's very difficult to capture a frightened deer, all the while holding on oh. with one hand to stop you from falling. He's but in the end, how do you rescue a deer? But what? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that is the sickest thing I've seen. He's hold. How do you hold a deer and drag it up with one hand? Just Jesus fuck. The heartbreaking cries of this oh, okay, it's a dog. injured and cold puppy. But when it realized that people won't uh. hurt, the puppy settled down and calmly went to a clinic with them. Uh, that's great. What would have happened to the little dolphin if it weren't for this kind man? Uh. Hmm. Fishing. That's pretty good. And here everyone deserves praise. The person rescuing the cat That's very and good. the cat who understood the assignment. Understood the assignment. Really? That's good. This porcupine swam towards people so that they could help it get on dry land. Huh. That's pretty smart, to be fair. This person sacrificed himself to protect his dog from two American Staffordshire Terriers. Fucking hell. Why are they so pissed off the koala from the netting? But what is it doing instead of running away? Ah. Oh. Oh, that's nice. Have a look at the way this dog climbs into the boat to save itself. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Fair enough. I feel like I don't have much to add to this video. This Pakistani kid is very poor, and to make a living he sells plastic he finds on the streets. Hmm. And yet he regularly buys milk for a stray cat. That's good. Fuck you. Yeah. that's what you call a quick reflex. He saw that quickly, fuck you know. This osprey got tangled in a fishing line, and in addition, the hook injured its right wing. But despite the pain, the bird is trying very hard to wow. get to the bow. How is it? It's just chilling. This mom cow was loudly very surprising. because her calf fell into a hole. <laughs> Thanks to its rescue, How the hell the end up was reunited with its mother. Dying. That's good. And this koala was stuck in a tree because of a flood. It was lucky to be noticed by Dang. people in a canoe. But like, if ever, if it was in a flood, surely that it could just stay in the tree until the water and stuff is gone. I mean, it, it probably still prefers being on land actually. <laughs> That is, that is weird, dude. Imagine fucking going into a deep dark hole just to say that. That is incredible to be fair. We're crying loudly as they fell through a storm drain. Getting oh my wasn't god. Easy, but the rescue team succeeded. Ah, that's quite nice. The baby swan was stuck in the fence, but its mother had nothing to worry about. It was in good hands. I was stuck in a fence, so okay. The, why are you slapping him then? The leg of this horse got stuck in the fence wire, and it's hard to say how long it would have stayed Dying. there if humans didn't come to its rescue. How, how did it get uh, I'm assuming he tried to jump it. And after a while, it was able to run again. 
I'm gonna wait, let that pretty fucking ancient. Oh, okay. It's it's did not take a, fish, a bit of a bit of time. The shark stole it for itself. Unfortunately, it bit off more than it could chew. And as a result, the diver had to help the shark. Uh, what other option did okay. she have? Of course, dolphins can survive for a little while without water, but they need help to avoid dying if they are beached. And so, many thanks to this person. Ah, oh, okay. That's pretty good. I didn't realize dolphins would swim that close to the shore to even have that as a risk. Chance, and it was right. Are you sure? I say it myself. Huh. Ah, come on, right? Yeah, I need I, I half expected it to just fucking barely flop onto the water. Small wild bird was hiding out from the 113 degree Australian heat in the car with people. So I mean, once it felt better, I swear the car the would also be to leave its saviors. as hot. I, I mean, I'm, I'm assuming the AC and shit is a lot cooler, I guess. But surely it's at least oh, close pesky enough. Little ducklings. The, Their mom had a bit the last one just jumped in. Oh, these pesky... What the... He's literally fine. Little ducklings. Jump. Their mom had a very stressful afternoon. But at least this story has a happy... What a twat. I... I... I secretly almost wish that one of them fell back into the tree. And this hedgehog was dehydrated and But that's sick. way too evil. I think we should all carry water with us exactly for such occasions. But only for hedgehogs. Not for, not for yet. During the low tide, this sea turtle got stranded on the shore upside down. But it was okay, very lucky no. to be found by these guys, because high tide wasn't due for another few weeks. Oh, okay. The foot of a fox got stuck in the football net, and it took real effort to free it. <laughs> wow. Huh. Thankfully, there were no injuries, and the cub was able to return to its mum without any problems. Uh, that's pretty good. The burrow of this raccoon collapsed, and it was trapped. Thankfully, two teenage mm -hmm. brothers noticed it, and managed to dig the animal out with their dad's help. Uh. In search for food, I mean, I, four puppies got I didn't see it get saved, tall. but okay. They couldn't move at all. But they still managed to cry for help. Wow. To clean the tar off their fur, people had to use oil and dishwashing fluid. And here's what they look like, like now. Ah. Nice. This six day old elephant was abandoned by the herd due to illness. But the locals saved it. Look how grateful the animal is to them. It was literally. What, what a bunch of pricks. They just left it. Pricks can obviously be what very the useful, but they are not meant for ice. Multiple deer got oh, stranded okay. in the middle of a frozen Fucking lake in Ontario, on. but a kind person in the oh oh, oh oh wow. And that doesn't Ontario, look but a kind that person doesn't look particularly helpful. And here's another example of a like I know technically it is helping, but <laughs> he's being dragged physically. And this brave person is risking his life to rescue a dog that what got stranded on the edge of the HPP dam. What the hell did the dog do to get that? What the f If it weren't for these guys, the sloth would have crossed the road in record time. <laughs> Only a week or so. Oh. Eh, I mean that. It's not exactly, was it wasn't really in trouble, like yes, the road it's on the road, time. but you probably could have seen it. A whole rescue team was needed to save a horse that got stranded during a flood. Look at the way the horse greets them with so much hope, knowing that these huh. people are here to help. That's pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, okay, that's pretty good. This boat was a saving grace for a drowning bear cub. It's a Just bear. look at all the effort it makes to climb aboard. Fuck you. And this elephant approached the doctors of its own volition so that they could treat the string it headache. Turns out someone shot the elephant in the, the head and the bullet got stuck in the skull. 
just a fraction of it an got shot in the head and yet it managed to go to find a doctor to cure itself this thing smarter than a lot this of you know it was starving for so long it turned into a living mummy it the was famished to move fortunately people responded to its cries for help and nursed it back to hell what the oh well, it is fine now and this that is fucking impressive because by jumping into a tourist boat <laughs> I mean, you know how like in National Geographic and stuff, you're not allowed to stop stuff killing each other. Surely that counts as well. The animal was searching for water. Once oh yeah, the latest wild predator calmly entrusts its life to people. Calmly is a a bit of a stretch. I didn't think it had much of a choice. Some surprise when they found seven fox cubs under their terrace. Seven. But where's their mom? Either way, people took great care of the cubs. <laughs> But look what happens. The mom fox returns oh, and collects her children one by one. <laughs> Not very good. The ear of this poor puppy was seriously injured and it was uh -huh. dealing with the pain alone until the puppy was found by people. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, it lost the ear. But at least it found a family and a happy life. Ah, that's pretty good. And here, people are delivering cows from mountains to comfortable alpine meadows. <laughs> that's all. Wait, I had dropped the sure fucking cow. Be sure to tell us in the comments about the time you killed a human animal. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Yeah, yeah, sure.